It is a surprise gift from one of the biggest names in Hollywood, and it landed on the doorstep of a business in Arlington. That shop specializes in repairing and restoring vintage typewriters. And as WBZ's Ken McLeod shows us, the owner just got a package from fellow typewriter collector, yeah. Academy Award winner Tom Hanks. This has been sitting so long, the ribbon's totally dried out. Tom Furrier pecked away on his new arrival today, surrounded by hundreds of typewriters awaiting repair. This is old school. Okay, here's our beauty. So in a way, it was routine when a German-made Olympia SM4 from the early 60s showed up via FedEx Tuesday, until the shop owner noted it was signed by Tom Hanks. Is Tom's signature? Yes, very surreal. It, it, it was like I was in shock the whole afternoon. There was a letter from the famed actor urging Furrier to help the typewriter keep doing its job for another hundred years. He loves typewriters just as much as I do. So that's a sturdy desktop machine. Indeed, Tom Hanks has been a typewriter buff for decades and has a huge collection of the semi-extinct writing machines. See? So many, he's begun farming them out to local typewriter hounds like Tom Furrier, who's run this cramp repair shop in Arlington for almost four decades. My whole thing is I want these typewriters to get used. Which is exactly what Hanks wants, to introduce keyboard generations to the tactile pleasure of the typewriter, bells and all. They've grown up with digital everything, and they come in and they try this, and they flip out. But it's the stories that come with each machine that Furrier so loves. We get cool stories, cool machines, cool customers, uh, but this one takes the cake. As for the fate of this vintage piece? I'm going to keep it initially. I'm going to recondition it, make it like new again, and then I'm going to give it away. Sell it, actually, to make a few bucks and possibly inspire a youngster to go old school. And when Tom Hanks is giving the commencement speech at nearby Harvard in May, who knows? I would love if he came and visited sometime. In Arlington, Ken McLeod, WBZ News.